Well, a rollover wreck in 2022 put then 23-year-old Shannon Davis in a wheelchair, left with nothing but time to think and a determination to walk again. Davis says the experience gave him a renewed passion for life that he is putting into everything he does. KTAB's Noel McKinney introduces us to this local artist with a tale to tell. It was around this time last year. I was like so busy. I was doing commissions left and right, working. I think it caught up to me to where my body just couldn't keep up with myself anymore. And I ended up having a seizure while driving. In 2022, now 24 year old Dias Airman, Shannon Davis was severely injured in a rollover crash that trapped him in his vehicle. I don't think there's a day goes by that I don't think about it. A shattered femur, broken hands, pelvis, and spine left him in a wheelchair with only a hope of recovery. And every day I just kept fighting. I was like, I have to be able to walk again. I'm in the military. I have all these things I need to do. The wreck put everything on hold, including his art, but he was determined to get back on his feet. Honestly, the fact that I'm here today was purely through the gift of God. I feel like I was extremely blessed to be here and still have the ability to create art because that's what I've always been extremely passionate about. He was commissioned by the owners of Retro World Arcade to adorn the walls of their new location with his work, a task he's taking on with renewed passion after his brush with death. It's kind of given me a different perspective upon my art that I create. It's given me more of a sense of joy. I feel like whenever I create pieces of art, I want to elicit that beauty. This scene of the character Goku staring into an imagined horizon emblematic of Davis' newfound outlook. Obviously Goku is a fictional character, but in my mind, I'm, I feel like he's seeing what I'm seeing, you know. Looking ever forward, excited for the possibilities the future might hold. Just a beauty in life. For BigCountryHomePage.com, I'm Noah McKinney. Amazing story, amazing young man. Absolutely. Mm, thank you, Noah. Well, Davis says he's been working on the murals for two weeks now, working quickly to meet the Halloween opening of Retro World's new location. He hopes his work will be enjoyed by all that visit and just maybe inspire others to put in the time to make their passions a reality as well. Truly a remarkable young man, mm -hmm. very inspiring to all of us, no matter yes. what. Great story. He's about overcoming adversity, my goodness. Yes. Wow, yes. what a great story. Noah did a great job putting it together and telling it. Thank you, Noah. Sure. Yeah.